Hello loves, if you have Libra as your rising, let's see what is going on with my Libra risings. You have Libra rising. Okay, so some of you guys are very optimistic. You guys are having fun right now, being very hopeful for a masculine figure, for the emperor to come in. For that masculine, for that the male authority, the father figure. For success, for fun, with this chariot. Um could also represent movement. Willpower, victory, determination, control. So yes, I feel like there's going to be a masculine here that is going to step in. And I am getting all fire energy right now. The sun card is Leo. The emperor is Aries, if I'm not mistaken. Let me double check. The chariot is Cancer, the Emperor, Aries. So yeah, like I said, this I'm getting fire here, Cancer. So my Libras may be dealing with someone that is a fire sign or possibly a Cancer. The Ten of Wands reverse, someone who has taken on too many responsibilities or this person is now avoiding their responsibilities. Get clarification on the sun form the sun card for fun warmth positivity the knight of cups in reverse as someone who's unrealistic who's jealous who's moody so someone that has taken on too, too many responsibilities and now are moody because of that. Someone who is unsure about which direction to take, possibly which person to go towards because they're stuck in the past. And they're releasing that fear to come in with some sort of communication. They have clarification on the emperor. Look at that. Ooh. The emperor is coming in. This could be someone praying about this. This could be an opportunity. This could be money being given to you. Um, with this Ace of Pentacles, this could be something that you guys are working on that is going to be um, a new fi financial opportunity, prosperity. So it's like two people were praying to one God. This could also mean religion. Someone may be stuck as far as their religion, the things that they represent, the things that they want. Um, may I have clarity on the chariot, please. What is the victory and willpower? I feel like someone's going to be stepping into their shit after, yep. Because someone was not standing in their truth, not standing in their authentic self. So I feel like with this chariot, this masculine possibly, with this king of wands in reverse here, that's, um, ruthless, high expectations, impulsiveness. So this could be someone that is changing for the better that is getting victory and willpower after being impulsive. Because again here, public recognition, clear thinking after this ace of wands in reverse. So after the delays, there's going to be public recognition in your marriage, in your community. We have the four of wands in reverse as well as the temperance. This is... Fire signs again here. Um, with the Ace of Wands in reverse, that is going to be again delays, lack of motivation, someone feeling like they are really weighed down. 
with the temperance in reverse here, this is someone that is imbalanced, that lack the long-term vision. Then with the um, four of wands in reverse, that could be a breakdown in communication. Transition, so someone making that transition after being in this, this position, yeah, releasing themselves with this eight of swords here. And then with the Six of Swords in reverse, that represents cannot move on because they're carrying baggage. What baggage are they carrying, Spirit? They're needing to rest and rejuvenate, recuperate. The baggage is someone who's bitchy, someone who's overly emotional. But look, and also someone who's trying to get away with manifesting conflict. So it's like someone is trying to cause this disruption in your life. <clears throat> May I have clarity on the Seven of Swords, please? Clarity on the Seven of Swords. Yep, something that fucked somebody up. Because look, someone is hurt here behind this. Because they weren't receiving, yep, being left out in the cold. But someone's still refusing to examine themselves. To step out on this new leaf. Like to step out on um, new turf. Try something new. That sort of thing. And then with the two of pentacles in reverse, that's disorganized, disarray. I feel like somebody got some demons they battling with. All right, spirit, let's get more clarity on this message. Clarity for the collective, please. told y'all somebody is refusing to grow this says growth it's like someone is having a hard time but like i said with that strength here someone has the strength and the faith a foolish man listens to his heart so again this masculine could be feeling like you know a foolish man will listen to his heart but in order to grow you have to have the faith the strength the endurance to accomplish whatever it is that you are trying to do Get more clarity. Cleverness, harmony, sensitivity, love. So yes, if this is what the master is trying to do in order to grow in love, then that is absolutely what it is that he is going to have to do. We don't know the future, but here's a cookie. So Spirit is saying they don't know the future, or you guys may be stuck like, I don't really know what the future holds for us, but you know, I'm only hoping... That someone could stand in their strength, stand, you know, in their authentic self. Actions speak louder than words. Actions speak louder than anything that I can tell you. You are needing to be free. You are needing to be passionate and think quickly. Like a cheetah. Self-love is the best love. I love your entire existence. So start loving on yourself, masculine. And know that even if you listen to your heart, it's not going to lead you in the wrong direction. If anyone is, you know, trying to pick up dirt and throw it at you, they're just going to lose ground underneath them. Unbreakable bond, solid. So you guys may have someone that you have an unbreakable bond with. That you are wanting to grow. Beauty, self-esteem. Yep. So somebody is needing to step into their, their authentic self. Tap into your self-esteem. Start working on your self-esteem. No contact. That may be why this person is in no contact with you. Alright, let's get clarity on no contact. Clarity on no contact spirit. 
yeah, like I said, they're stuck. They got to make the choice. They don't know which way to go. Their emotions are blocked. This is a stalemate. Clarification on no contact. Outside influences. But there's going to be movement. Someone is going to stand in their power. And I'm so very thankful for that. Because our masculine have been sleepy. Spirit, what messages? King, like I told you, my masculine. Y'all better get it together, kings. In the springtime, fucked your friend. Oh, you want to argue? I don't argue, baby. So, like I said, this person was trying to get around with doing some shit. This person could have fucked your friend in the springtime. And that could have been what you guys were arguing about. Damn, must be dirty as fuck. <laughs> oh, my God. What do you need to tell this masculine besides, nigga, you dirty as fuck? You haven't learned how to communicate and you need to learn how this winter... Especially before you try to come to someone else and tell them, look, are you going to take my heart and then leave me? Like I said, especially if you're going to come to someone else and tell them, you know, our happiness means the world to me. I want to go half on a baby or whatever. But then you're humiliating your person. Like, come on, kings, you got to get it together. Of course, she's going to argue because you are humiliating her. You're fucking with somebody that she knows. Name calling. I'm yours till we die. So someone may be calling other people names. A single parent, flued out, coach, artist. Yeah, so they may have been dealing with someone else. <clears throat> they may have been actually leaving the state or leaving the city to go and be with someone else. You guys may be a coach or an artist or your person is. And, you know, you may have told them, look, bye, I, I can't deal with this bullshit. Yeah, look. Like, they were supposed to be supportive, but they wasn't. So, he's like, look, refund, send your ass back to the street. Again, here with a coach. This is a coach. This is a football coach, basketball coach, some sort of coach or a fan or a player you know, that is possibly, you remind me of my mother, that is possibly having these mother issues that they need to work through because they may be dealing with someone who is a party animal or that maybe they're a party animal and maybe going on vacations with other people, traveling to places with other people. And you may have been ignoring the red flags. What the fuck did I tell y'all? And y'all were ignoring the red flags. It's okay to cry, but don't sit in that shit. Send a motherfucker on their way and keep it pushing because of these side hoes. And you're taking this glow up personal. Although you couldn't imagine life without this person, they needed to grow the fuck up. No call, no show, so they're fired. This person is acting numb to the pain because they need to grow the fuck up. They're saying, why would we be arguing? We can be fucking. Okay, well, we could be doing that, but it's like you're with everybody else. So I'm not sure. I'm yours till we die. When I tell you I love you, do you believe me? No, this person does not because they are worried sick. Look, now this person's like, look, this is me versus me. I made the absolute wrong turn. Now I am needing to set boundaries and to live in my authentic self. And because it's going to hurt like hell that I got to let this person go. But again, grieving is a part of life. Pick up and go. Divorce me. So some of you guys may be divorced or wanting a divorce because it's no closure and no compromising. Give me that D, bloody sex, pregnant, homie lover, friend. 
So this person could have gotten your friend pregnant or could have um homie lover friend and bloody sex. I feel like they could have had sex with someone while they were on their period. Someone is abusive and they do not like kids and they are in survival mode right now. Sheesh. Protection. So either masculine you are needing to make sure that you are using protection or feminine you are protected throughout the fuck shit self-harming so yeah you are protected while your person is out here cutting the fuck up on this message i do love you so your person is sending a direct message look i told you he's sending a direct message and saying i do love you 888 for abundance if you have been saying 888 know that you are going to receive abundance you are going to receive money but again your person is tapping in and letting you know that they do love you although they may have some sex or porn addictions this may be a false twin flame. Oh, okay, okay. So they may have a sex addiction and they are trying to have a new beginning with their false twin flame because they have hit rock bottom. This shit is hard. So this shit may be hard for whoever is involved in this. Replace them fast. Mom or dad, conquer all. Being held to a higher standard, person in prison, serial lover. This is the same message from earlier. Kind of. What am I picking up on? Look, new beginnings here. Zero, zero, zero. Crooked smile. On my way, on my way, on my way down. My way, on my way, on my way down. I know it's hard, my darling. You keep falling based because you're insecure. They keep telling you you're beautiful, but you're not sure. Avoiding change, love on the brain. So again, this masculine could be tell could be avoiding the changes that they need to make although love is on their mind brown skin between the ages of 40 and 50 you smell so good so this person this masculine may smell good new beginnings whoa love to read and write so you may start to read and write more than you did. New beginnings. Or it could be something that you're reading or writing to help you with this new beginning. Reading and writing and new beginning. I keep my eyes focused on my goals and release any fears as I open my heart to the universe. Yeah, so this could be something that this person is writing out. Writing down. Only build with those who want it as bad as you. So this person that is learning that they can only build with those who are wanting to build. You know, you can't force someone to do something. Dark skin popped up again. So this is definitely for someone that is dark skin with their own house and car. I got dark skinned earlier. Forty and fifty year old, what's going on with this forty and fifty in age? Years of time in this. 
So this may be something that you have dealt with for years. I don't want no problems. Maybe something that you've dealt with for years and now you're just like, ah, I don't, I don't even, you know, know if I even want to deal with this. Georgia, I love your eyes, prostitute, too little effort, and pill and drug addiction. So again, someone was not giving effort because they were giving their efforts to a prostitute. Sheesh. What is this new beginning pertaining to? Our bond is unbreakable. New beginnings for a bond that is unbreakable to be found. So again, you guys are going to have a new beginning coming up for you. Possibly with a white man. Especially if you guys are having health complications. I am grateful to have you. I stand on what I said. We don't chase holes between the ages of 30 to 35. And forgiveness. Health complications. Let's see what's going on with their health complications. Android user. So an Android user is having health complications. I have a health deck too, so we can tap into that. Don't let me go. I'm ready for your love. Mexican. Hope is worth a try. And I do no wrong syndrome. Going through the dark night of the soul and family piss because they lack self-confidence. Self-confidence. Oh, I have one more card up here. Shit ain't as good as it seems. So if they are out with another person, it's not as good as it seems. Parents or addicts, be still and sit in meditation position. This is if your parents are an addict or if you are a parent and you are an addict, you are needing to sit still to get in position for meditation in order to release this foolishness. Small amount of money is coming. So you guys are going to be getting some sort of money. I told y'all was some money coming in somewhere with that Ace of Pentacles. The end. Praying man that's coming in about this situation with this blonde in West Virginia that he has been giving or getting gifts from. Coach, mom or dad, 666, invite peace. Nothing is out of reach. Let's go on a date movement. So again, I told you, I feel like this person is going to be getting their shit together after they are closing some chapter out with 999. Youth, a child. So this person, you could have a child with this person or this black man when you feel triggered. Why you ask yourself, why do you feel triggered? Why do you go and risk it with evil ass people? Ask yourself that. Masculines, what message do you have for the masculines? The masculine energy, divine masculine. Community pussy, summer, hold on. So if you again fuck around with somebody in the summertime. South Carolina, lazy motherfucker. You can be real with me. Keep loving yourself and twerker. 
I got this in my last message. What in the fuck do y'all folks got going on? Somebody is all over the place. And I said they were traveling. I said traveling home. Awareness. Somebody's getting awareness of what's going on right now. Somebody that's hitting licks to maintain their own stability with a white woman. Your light angers their demon. I know who I am. Can I hit it in the morning? 20 plus. So this person that they are creeping around with, maybe tw in their 20s, the soul always knows how to heal itself. The problem is to silence your mind instead of being defensive. You strong ass feminine energy. Soul sister, soul brother. Like I said, they were sleeping with somebody that you know. Paying for pussy. That's it right there. It's like they were giving somebody either money or gifts to have sex with them. <clears throat> but you are needing feminine to balance how you respond and react. Figure out what is the best case in this situation because you have the ability to make anything more beautiful. Not sure that you would necessarily want to, but there's an uncommon name who is unable to change because they are doing shit that they usually don't do and they like it. If you let them kill your dreams, it'll haunt you. Someone is walking away from an evil ass person being released from burdens because someone's efforts haven't gone unnoticed in California. Someone is using it to help me kill this thing over. Let's see what's going on with Cali. California knows how to party in the city. See up Compton. Just keep it rocking. Keep it right there. Oh, shit. Minor child chlamydia 30 plus. Okay, so I really hope that your person was not sleeping with a minor child. Mm, let me see. Minor child. Look, it really thirsty was right there. Ooh. Minor child. Beautiful soul and smile. Community dick. Release your uniqueness. Music reminds me of you. Meditation music. I might cuff it. So yes, I am taking it as if someone. 555 August. Mommy issues. If you aren't checking in to see how you are. Yes, this is all the same shit. Y'all, go and check out my other message. I'm about to cut this one off because this is the same fucking shit. It is a hairdresser here. It is somebody that's community dick. I got Cali. I got West Virginia. I have been picking up on this chlamydia. So, I don't know what the fuck y'all folks got going on. But, please make sure that you are going to the doctor to be checked. Especially if you have a mate that is fucking all over the place. Because, oh my god. Y'all do not want them problems. I'm going to check through with this, this health shit. And we're going to see. So this is somebody either pregnant or somebody got a disease. Or hell, this could be both. I could be picking up on multiple different people. But let's figure out. Where's my health deck? Great spirit guides, ancestors of the highest good, give us clarity on this health issues. Who has health issues? Libra rising. Those who have Libra rising. Leo, I told you, and Gemini. So these could be the people that are involved, Sagittarius and Aquarius. I told you I was picking up on all of those 
So this could be kidney issues. This could be heart, digestive system. Libra, Aries, I told y'all I was getting fire signs here. Let me see who is for the Wheel of Fortune. That is fixed signs. Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus, and Leo. Aries here again. This could be your sign. This could be some of the things that's going on with you. Spirit, let's get clarity on what is going on with the health complications. The liver. Shoulder or arms or reproductive system. Taurus, Gemini, and Libra for justice. Shoulder, arms, liver, or reproductive system. There could be something wrong with your shoulder, something wrong with your reproductive system, or something wrong with your liver. Yeah, Aquarius, Aries. So I'm getting fire in... Um, just this card again. Digestive system. Let's see what's going on with the health complications, spirit. Ancestors of the highest good. Health complications. The king of pentacles. This could be a masculine that's having health complications. Health complications. Could be just a mental, not even necessarily actually something wrong with them. One more for health complications. The five of cups in reverse. Holy smokes. Five of cups in reverse is moving on acceptance or forgiveness. King of Pentacles is security, control, discipline, and abundance. So again, if you guys just get disciplined, then your abundance will fall through. Your healing will fall through. You guys, I am definitely seeing the dark night of the soul here. So that is, look, fear and illusions. Giving and taking the balance with the Libra here. I said something about a Libra. What is the moon sign? Let's see what the moon sign is. The moon sign is Pisces. It's maybe someone that you're dealing with. Or um, if not someone that you are dealing with, then this is just the energy. Fear of illusion about your person possibly giving what it is that you are supposed to have to someone else. Your... Um, Yeah, giving, sharing, prosperity. So, yeah. That's what I think is more so a mental thing than anything. Yeah. The Empress in reverse. That's a creative block because my Libras are depending on others. Look at that with the battle. The conflict, disagreements here. So, yeah, I think it's more so a mental thing than anything. Let's see what other messages Spirit has for you guys before I end this message. Oh, moving on. Uncovering crime. Avoiding moving on. Yeah, because look, at the bottom of it, resisting change. Delaying the inevitable. Masculines, you're going to have to tap in, baby. What's going on, child? 
Gossip, no social life, broken promises, cheater, shattered dreams. I told y'all somebody is trying to get away with some shit. Debt, collapsing of empire, fighting over money, family feud. The road to glory may be bumpy, but it is absolutely worth it, love. This person and their mental health issues that is a liar they are going to make the choice for a union your spirit guides are protecting you from this person that is over critically rude Malicious and manipulative. The cheater. Someone who may have an absent mom. Maybe the mom was never around. Maybe the mom passed. Something in that nature. Look. Letting go of folks. Giving to others. Large purchases. Gambling. Broke. So this person may have went broke. Because they were trying to give other people shit. But they are going to be um, going through and healing their childhood issues and finding inner strength, overcoming their self-doubt. What's the outcome for this spirit? Suddenly leaving a business partner, two paths. Waiting to go overseas. So again, this person is like waiting to leave whatever bullshit it is that they have to withdraw from. I want you to boost my ego. So yeah, leaving that ego bullshit behind. They don't, they... Are wasting their time. Lack of spark. It's because the spark is no longer there in their life. They're reckless and distracted. And again, the lack of faith. Psychic. So someone's uh, psychic, spiritually discerning the success, the completion. Look. Once they follow their heart. The gentleman, the proposal, the dating, the good news. All of that is coming in afterwards. This masculine is just going to have to fucking get to it. Right? Thank you guys for watching me. Um, Actually, before I let you go, let me get one more. Just so we can get clarity on the past, present, and future for the collective. Past, present, and future. On the soulmate connection. For this connection. Past energy, please. Past energy. <clears throat> Addiction. So again, someone was in this codependent energy. Feeling uplifted, maybe spending time with your friends after you found out about the other woman. You, oh, no, that's you finding out previously you found out about them linking up with the other woman, going out, doing whatever with the other woman. What is the present energy right now for the collective, the current state? Stability, security, endurance, flexibility, and growth. So again, things are going to grow. What is the future? Look, Cupid's arrow. Have faith, love is coming. A surprise invitation or meeting. Future. The future was stabbed in the back. And meeting someone new, getting back out there, planning or setting a date. 
So again, after the bullshit, it's going to be someone coming in after they reclaim their power. Look, an abundance fell out again. One more. Lightning. You're going to suddenly find out about this. Or you may suddenly get abundance coming in. Thank you, Spirit, for that confirmation. Look, and then I like you fell out. This person is not showing it because they're listening to their ego right now. Not showing their feelings. Gaslighting. But then the outcome is someone likes you and someone's wanting to date. So thank you, loves. I pray that this message reach all of those it is intended to. Bless your journey and may you have a good day. Love you. Bye.